Moving into the world of movies at the Daytona Beach Comic Book Convention, I have Joel D. Winecoop here with me, director, writer, creator, also comic book artist, too. Yes, I'm delving into the, I'm not as good as Jim Fern over there, or Austin Janowski, or even Roland Mann, but I'm giving it my best shot, or John Crowther, but wow. I'm giving it my best shot. You, uh, or even George over there. George yeah. is an awesome, awesome artist. And, and, I'm and, trying to get to his level. And Humphrey Ching <clears throat> over there, too. Yes, I'm doing what I can to become that caliber legend, of legend. artist or legend yes, yes. the yes. legend yes he, he's trying to get his way into free comic book day that's what that's, that's what you're going it. for right cuz yeah I want to get back and find out why Batman's now Robin and Robin has become Batman that's not true. But Batman's I back. Now. thought I'd say that. Well, yeah. Robin did become Batman for a while. Yeah, yeah, he did in that future issue that I didn't follow. Now, now just out of curiosity, <laughs> is, is Joel going to go to like the Batman versus Superman kind of movie? Would you actually go? Do you go to those big blockbuster kind of films or you oh, just avoid them? Oh, no, absolutely. Yeah, my wife and I, are, we are going. Um, what is it, Sunday the 25th? Sunday the Easter Sunday. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, great, Easter, great Sunday, Easter but, movie. Well, I, I think the Lord will forgive me because he knows I'm a big Batman, Superman fan. So oh, okay. we will be there to see Dawn of Justice. Yes, right. it looks awesome. Who, who are you rooting for there? You know, the bat or oh, I, I, No, I, 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 just, I just go both because everybody's like, oh, Superman, oh, Batman. I just go Batman and Superman both rule and they get along and they're in the Justice League. So. And, and when we this, grew up, they were in the this, world's finest. Remember? Yeah, and world's finest was like the equivalent to Marvel team up with Marvel. Yeah. World's finest was the DC version where everybody would team up with either Superman or Batman. And then, of course, Batman and Superman. But well, yeah, this is going to be cool. And then, you know, you know, at the end, they might be doing all this fighting, but it's, it's going to end with the old handshake and the, call and, me if you need me, I'll be in my cave. I like that. Right, Batman, I don't know. <laughs> was that Wonder Woman? No, that was Wonder no, Woman, no, yeah. Okay, I yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And plus, we, she, she smokes a lot in this show. It's, it's Lucy as Wonder yeah, Woman. Yeah, yeah. She's like, eh, Batman, Superman, follow me. Who was that? That was Wonder Woman. <laughs> oh. Instead of, you know, Ricky, you'll be, Steve, where yeah, are you, Steve? Yeah, yeah. I'm looking for Steve Trevor. Where are you? So, I want to have his babies. Okay, enough of that. Sorry. Okay, okay. <laughs> the wild man here. And, and of course, are you are you going to get into the Captain America Civil War thing, or is that just too oh, dark Oh, I've for already you? been into the Civil War oh. thing. Don't get me started. I can tell you the entire Civil War rundown from all the books. Well, So it, this, in, in the Civil War movie, Captain America 3 Civil War, they'll, they'll never hardly even touch what they did in the books with Nova coming back from the, the Annihilation world, coming back to and Nova, with, with the, he's still a youngster, basically, and he's uh, yelling at Captain America saying, what are you guys doing? And Captain America's, we're fighting over our, our freedom of our secret identities. And Nova's like, you guys are fighting over your secret identity. Basically, Nova was going, you guys are a bunch of morons, and you've been at this a lot longer than I have. I've only started in, uh, what was it, the, the late 70s meeting Spider-Man, and I know better than all of you guys. I mean, and because here in the, in the movie, you've only got Cap and Falcon and Black Panther right. and Spidey and Iron Man and Ant-Man and uh, somebody else, I think, and fighting against you know each other. But in the comics, it was everybody. It was the X-Men, it was Fantastic, Fantastic Four. Four. It was everybody. Spidey, Daredevil everybody. gets locked up in the jail. Yep. Spidey was um, uh, working with uh, 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 Iron Man first, I believe. Yes. yes. And then he went over to Cap's side because he just saw it. He goes, I don't know if this is right or and not. And the Punisher goes off on his own kind of yeah, a little bit. Yeah, Punisher was and, doing and, his own thing. Yeah. He wasn't really in involved with them as much but yeah for them to do it the budgets are always gigantic now yeah. they would be whatever oversized but no i'm looking forward to that too it's still going to be cool and especially when the trailer when spidey fires down his web and yanks yeah. up cap yeah. shield and, and iron man goes under ruse and he fires it down he pulls it up and goes hey everybody you're thinking <laughs> steve ditko there with the art probably a little yeah bit. That, the yeah, steve yeah, ditko yeah. stuff is awesome yeah from way back in the day but joel yeah. before i let you go here okay because i know you got to get to dealing with some fans and stuff no i don't i have yes, no you, fans yes he does everybody he does. hates me <laughs> people are coming by throwing Pepsi cans no, at me. No. They were like, is that wine coop? And then Pepsi cans, no. cobs of corn. But one of them came and it had no. corn on it. I was no. like, oh man, no. I told my wife, I'm starved. We didn't get any lunch no. here today. Tom Rob's cheapskate. He didn't give me a damn thing to eat. That promoter. So I, was like, yeah, I know it. So I was eating the corn. I was like, Tom, you got some butter. You know, and he was like, wine coop, why don't you just shut your mouth you know, and be happy I got you here. I, I have was some like, complaints all right, about, I know. I have I complaints know. about him too. Let's complain. Yeah, yeah he's just <laughs> annoying. Yeah, he is. Walks around. He's got this Hitler mentality. And, and, he's got and people come up to him and they go, hey, Tom, did you get my space? Shut up. No, you take that little box, you sleep in a box in the street, and that's where you set your comic books up at. And yep. the guy, remember the guy down there? Yes. Usher, Usher Johnson. Yep. He's got a cardboard box. A card, it's way over there, Kimmy. You can't see it, even if way you use your there. Zoom. It's so far. It's a card. Trust me. It's a cardboard box. The guy's sitting inside the cardboard box with some corn chips and a bottle of water that Tom gave me. He goes, you have corn chips, a bottle of water, and try and sell that comic. And if you give you any more crap, I'll kick you in the teeth. No, Tom was trying to do this. He was like... 
kick you in the teeth. I he's know. trying to do. I know. I know. I know. He's evil. Tom Rop is evil. Evil, evil, evil promoter. Evil promoter. Yes. It's like Doctor Doom, yes. Doctor Octopus, and Lex Luthor and all Red Skull into one. And Red Skull. Yeah. Yeah. It's like Red Tom Rop. Yeah. Yeah. Watch oh, out for him. He will kill you. Watch out, Daytona. It's, yeah. It's just like you're walking up there. Tom Rop, how's it going? Bam! That's how it's going. Get out of my face. I'm Tom Rop, and I rule. Bam! Bam! Exactly. Bonk! Bonk on the head. Well, Joel, I'm gonna let you get back to your non-fans here. Nah, none yeah, of yeah, them yeah, they yeah, hate yeah. me. But before I let you go, how many movies have you done? Either directed, written, or starred in? I've done a little over 120 movies, <laughs> and they're released all over the country and all oh. over the uh, all over the world. And my voice is dubbed in a whole bunch of. Languages I don't even know. I watched uh, Killing Spree in Italian the other night, and I go, I don't know what I'm saying, but it's kind of cool. Whoa. <laughs> so you're like the John Carradine, because I remember his film, he's like 200 films. That, that was that. Um, that was actually an article. Um, there's a guy in the paper. What's that guy in the, in the Tampa Times? What's his name? He's going to kill me now. You're going to show him this video, and he's going to be, you can't even remember my you name. You remember me. But he said the uh, Keith, or I think it was Carradine of... Um, yeah, Christopher Lee. Yeah, he said he called me the Christopher Lee of yeah. independent B movies or something. Yeah, so kind of in that Carradine level and all back in the 50s and everything. So, if so you, that was kind of neat. If you love horror films and you love to talk about comic books and horror films and all those kind of things, see him, Joel D. Yeah. Winecoop. Where, where will you be next? Because at least four people like my movies. At least four people. And only only two people have seen hey. Truth or Dare, but at least four people have seen the rest of my movies. Our goal is to make it five. 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 I, I need one more person yes. to just, if we had a like meter on this like they do on like on Talking Dead yeah. and they go you know right in and see what this is and it'll the levels of what we should have that on here but Kimmy's going to get on that next time five. for a level to get five I need yes. five fans five because I've got four fans at home they all got those plugs but they, none of them work are so they relatives one yeah no they're no no they're the fans that oh, you plug in oh, and you okay, turn the little you. switch on oh. yeah wow. there's a big fan a little yeah. fan I got a round one and a square one where will you be next now I'll be back here in November Woo. 